nostril this morning, and his air went into our lung, his lung that he gave us. So we're going to uh, make a joke and all before the Lord. So right now, I'm going to pray right now, and, and after I'm done praying, somebody get a scripture, okay? All right. Thank you, Father God, for this day, Lord. Oh, Father God, Lord, this is the day that you have made, and we are going to be glad and rejoice in it, Father God. We thank you, Father, for this day. We thank you for Jesus. We thank you, Jesus, for going to the cross for us. We thank you for shedding your precious blood for us. And we thank you for the leading of the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for guiding us with your eye. Thank you for being the spirit of truth who leads us into all truth. We thank you for everything, Lord. Lord, if we had 10,000 tongues, we could not thank you enough, Father. But we thank you for everything. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for your love. We thank you for your mercy, Father. Thank you, Father. Father, we just love you and we adore you. Lord, we come to you with a, with a repentant heart. Anything we said, any, anything of deed, word, or thought, wrong pattern of thinking, Father, we ask that you forgive us, Father God. You tell us that we can come boldly to the throne of grace, that we may obtain mercy to find grace to help in time of need. We need you, Lord. We need you. We can't do without you, Father. Oh, Father, we want to stay connected to the true vine. Without you, Lord, we're shipwrecked, Father God. We need you every day. We need you every hour. We need you every minute. We need you every second, Father God. I thank you, Father. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good and his mercy endures forever. We thank you for being our brightest morning star. We thank you for being our day star. We thank you for being our refuge and our fortress, our strong tower. We thank you, Father God. You are a strong deliverance, Father God. We just praise you, Father God. We glorify you, Father God. I lift up my hands before you this morning, Father God. I lift up my hands and my voice before you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father, for hearing my cry as I cry out to you this morning, Lord. I praise you and I glorify you, Father. Thank you for everything. Thank you, Father God, for my family. Thank you for my children. Thank you for my husband. Thank you, Father God, for leading us and guiding us each day. Thank you, Father God, that no weapon form against us shall prosper. And every tongue that rises against us in judgment, you shall condemn. Ours is the inheritance and servants of the Lord, and our righteousness is into you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Lord, I thank you for bringing Chris in. I thank you for bringing Alvin in. I thank you for bringing Roland in. I thank you for bringing the lost in. Bring her from the north. Bring her from the south. Bring her from the east. Bring her from the west, Lord. Oh, Father, hear my cry. You say the effect and fervent prayer of the righteous avails much, Father God. As I cry to you, Father God, touch them this morning, Father God. When they need a touch at this morning, Father God. Bring them, Father God. Oh, Father God, that they may have spiritual insight, Father God, that they may receive Jesus Christ into their heart as their personal Savior. I thank you, Father God, for Stacy. I thank you for Mariah. I thank you for Trey. I thank you for Last Call Ministry family, Father God. I thank you for those that have called in the Last Call Ministry, Father. I thank you for your protection over them, Father God. I thank you, Father God, for using them at such a time as this, Father God, to proclaim the good news of Jesus Christ. I thank you for peace in their home. I thank you for love and their home. I thank you for joy in their home, Father God. I thank you, Father God. I bind the work of Satan right now in the name of Jesus. I bind your, the, 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 I bind everything that you try to bring into to my family. I bind it right now in the name of Jesus. I bind that lust spirit. I bind that demonic spirit. I bind, Father God, that witchcraft spirit. I bind it off the church in the name of Jesus. I bind, Father God, deception. I bind unbelief. I bind it right now in the name of Jesus. I bind that worry spirit. I bind that poverty spirit. I bind that deception spirit right now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you. You've given us power to thread upon serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy and nothing shall by no means hurt us. So Satan, you are a defeated foe. Jesus, crucified, Jesus died on the cross 2,000 years ago and the work is finished and I will more than a conquer in Christ Jesus because the battle is not ours. The battle has already been won and we shall prevail. We shall prevail. Thank you. We have already prevailed. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for the cross. Thank you for the blood. Thank you, Father, for knowing to my husband this morning as he brings the word of God.
to the people today, Father God. Let them not just be hearers of the word, Father God, but let them be doers of the word, Father God. Oh, Father God, let the word, you said the word is sharper than a two-edged sword, Father God. Let your word precise and cut us, Father God, where we need to be cut at, Father God, that we may grow, Father God, and mature in the faith, Father God. I thank you, Father God. You say, Father God, in your word, Father God, that your word is powerful, Father God. Your word is powerful. Your word, Father God, how sweet are your words to my taste, but they are sweeter than honey. Thank you. Your words are now to my feet and a light to my path. Thank you, Father God. Thank you that we keep our affection on things above and not on things on this earth. Because these things on this earth, Father God, they're going to perish, Father God. But things on and above, Father God, they're going to last forever, Father God. Thank you, Father God, for working us into the kingdom of God, Father God. That when we get there, Father God, you say, well done, my good and faithful servant. Oh, Father God, cleanse us, Father God. Cleanse our heart. Cleanse our mind. Cleanse our thought, Father God. Anything in us that's not like you. Take it out right now, Lord Jesus. Wash us through the word of the word. Wash us through the word of the word. That we have a pure heart. Because only the pure heart will see you, Father God. Purify us, Lord. Purify us right now, Father God. Purge us. Purge us, Father God, right now in the name of Jesus. I love you. We adore you. We praise you. Lord, I pray for the sick this morning. I thank you for going in the hospital, touching those that need a touch in their bodies this morning. Thank you for touching those in the nursery home that need a touch in their bodies this morning. Thank you for touching those that are going to find in their home. Thank you for touching them this morning in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, that you are Jehovah Rapha. You are a healer. You healed us 2,000 years ago on the cross. Thank you for touching everyone, Father God, that need a touch right now, Cousin Jane. Thank you for touching my cousin Pat. Thank you for touching Cousin Evelyn Joy. Thank you for touching my husband. Thank you for touching my mom, my dad. Thank you, Father God, for touching our loved ones that need a touch right now in the name of Jesus, Father God. Thank you, Father God, that I speak your word. I thank you that your word never returned back to you, Lord, but it always accomplished what it was sent out to do. Thank you, Father. Thank you for everything. I love you. We adore you. Oh, Father God, I pray, Father God. Oh, I thank you for hearing my cry. I thank you, Father God. I pray for the church this morning, Father God. I pray that the church would come together on one accord, Father God. Oh, Father God, I pray for the prophets. I pray for the pastors. I pray for the teachers. I pray for the evangelists. I pray, Father God, for the missionaries around the world that are doing your work, Father God. Let them not get weary and well doing, Father God, but they shall reap if they faint not. Let them keep pressing, pressing, preparing, preparing the things of you, Father God. Let them keep pressing toward the Mark of the prize of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus. Oh, Lord, I thank you. Thank you for strengthening them right now, Father God. Let them have a kind heart, Father God, one to another. Let our speech always be with grace, seasoned with salt, so that we'll know how to answer every man, Father God. Oh, Father God, let's have a forgiving heart, Father God, because, Father, you love us so much that you gave your only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in you shall not perish, but have everlasting life. We thank you for everything. We thank you, Father. Thank you for everything. And we give you all the praise. We give you all the honor. And I cry out to you, Lord God Almighty, who is, who was, and is to come. To God be the glory. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 Praise God.